Yeah, and <laughs> welcome everyone, and hello, and I'm just recording this right now after the announcement. Um, yeah, the new DLC, um, the Wetlands Animal Pack um, was just announced, now coming on April the 12th, and wow, um, <laughs> I just have to <laughs> focus myself for a bit, but uh, because we are getting an a um, ton of amazing new animals. Um, I have here the official official forum post. Um, yeah, welcome eight new animals from across the wetlands with, this, with the new Planet Zoo Wetlands Animal Pack coming to you on April 12th alongside the free 1.9 update. You should you're sure to have fun with no other than the lovely capybara. We knew this already from yesterday's live stream. Uh, the oddity that is the platypus. I'm really I'm surprised about that one because they are quite rare in zoos, to be honest. Um, the adorable Asian small clawed otter. Really, really like that. Really like that. Um, the stealthy spectacled caiman. Um, not have not seen that coming, but we had a crocodile yesterday, so it was uh, in the realm of possibility. Um, the sturdy whitewater buffalo. Really cool. Um, really cool to get another bovine in the, in the DLC, uh, in the game, and uh, the elegant red crown crane, now this is a really a surprise, um, getting another bird is kind of rare in this game, and we all hoped, we all hoped for, yeah, um, for a bird's DLC, for more birds in this game, but now we get one, um, I'm, not sh I'm sure he is not flying, but, um, yeah, getting a new, a new bird uh, at for once is really cool. Um, the Agile Neil Liché, um, I have no idea what it is, um, I just googled all the animals, but it seems to be some kind of antelope, um, an African water antelope. Um, really cool, I love the how they do the antelopes in the game, so really looking forward to that one. Um, yeah, uh, and we get a new, you can also incise gas with a new exhibit animal, the smallest of its species, the Danube Crested Newt. Um, I haven't seen that in the haven't seen that so far. Um, I know it from pictures, but really interesting to see that. And it's our second newt after the fire salamander. Um, oh yeah, so really cool. And wow, this is just not expected. We all thought about South America. Um, yeah, tropical DLC, but this is really cool. Okay, what else is here? I didn't even read the po uh, blog post so fast. I was with that. Uh, you need. You, all, uh, you will need some new enrichment, really, to help celebrate with your new animal friends. Uh, your cabaros will live their best life as they indulge in a soak with the new hot water tap, spruce up your underwater areas with the new small underwater feeder and underwater buoy, and have a splash in the sun with the new natural water jet. So, um, a lot of water enrichments, of course, is the wetland DLC. But yeah, we get a hot water tap. Okay, so we get like, yeah, like a, a shower piece. Um, so you get another feeder, an underwater buoy. Um, Interesting to see how that looks and then natural water jack also cool to see what that looks like and if it looks different from the water jet We have in game that is more yeah more plasticky more um, yeah artificial We are also bring we will also bring you a new time scenario in this time set in the Pantanal in Brazil Brazil's or South America's biggest wetland area help rescue animals who can't return in, uh, to the wild um, To the wild finds their forever home with this high welfare requirement challenge. Okay, real cool I hope we get a nice capybara sign. I mean, look at this guy. It's wow. It's, it's so fluffy and cute. I love it already. Um, yeah, as mentioned in update 109, our next free update will bring to you some behavioral changes. The new bathing behavior will also be enjoyed by the water loving capybara, of course, and the burrowing behaviors will be expanded to indulge the platypus. Okay, really cool. Um, yeah. Um, wow, we are so we get new burrowing behavior also for platypus, which is also really come. So, uh, this is, I mean, we all thought about what could be birds, aquatics, uh, yeah, South America and Tropical was now after the stream very much coming, but um, this is really cool. Um, do we have more pictures? Yeah, we have some of the water buffalo here. Um, really like how they look. They look really, really realistic. Um, but yeah. Really amazing. Um, I can't wait. Again, um, April 12th, so in around two, f two and a half weeks, we get this new pack really out of, of um, out of expectation. So I think nobody has seen that coming. And But really cool, especially Capybara, Platypus, and all Asian small 
other as well as a red crown crane are animals that I really like to have and I'm just now starting to think how can I uh, incorporate them in my zoos and my plants, maybe even in Raven Creek. But yeah, um, really cool, really cool. And yeah, we will we will follow th what they post over the next days, more animals um, facts, um, and see how more more of the animals they show. It's really amazing. Uh, leave me down in the comments um, what you think um, and what your favorite animal is, especially. And yeah, I see you in the next video. Um, should there should be one up i think around thursday or friday so our usual raven creek video but until then i hope you are as hyped as i am and i hope i see you um yeah on friday in the stream so yeah goodbye everyone have a nice day and yeah <laughs> the new dlc just announced so have a great day i see you next time <laughs> goodbye